Oh, come on, right here. I don't know, dude. I don't know. What's up, everybody? How's it going? It's me, Marcus, back here in Descenders, and for this video, I am going to be doing some runs down the 2019 Crankworks Rotor Rule course on the Hardtail Dirt Jumper. This is gonna be a lot of fun. This is going to be the perfect course for this bike to really test it out and just kind of see how this bike is in the game. I know I've already ridden it once uh, to kind of test it out, but I feel like this is going to be the perfect course for it. Just a downhill slope style course. So I have not ridden the course, so I don't know. I, I don't know the course. I have seen a video or two of some runs down this course. But, I mean, yeah. <laughs> find me a better course for this bike in this game. I don't think you can. Maybe the um, the Red Bull course the that I did in a previous video that was a slope style course. Oh, flip flip. And then front flip off. This is my first run on this thing. Oh, 360 backflip toe whip. Double, nope, that's not going to happen. I'm really surprised that I got a full run top to bottom on my first go. Red Bull Joyride, I'm also going to ride that one in this video. I just thought about it, I was like, that was pretty easy. Uh, this bike works really good on this course. Why not take it over to Joyride and see how it is there as well? Because again, this bike is made for, oh, I've rotated it and then brought it back. Uh, it's made for courses like this. <laughs> Front flip flip. Oh, there we go. Can I get a 720? I don't know if this jump's big enough. No, it is. Perfect. Front flip, tuck no hander. Tabletop on top. Yeah. Oh, it's so fun. Oh, I'm gonna come short. Right into the sides. That was the ugliest tabletop I think I could have, I could have done. Backflip bar spin. I do a tip. Oh, there's so. There are two different bar spins. There's that one where it turns to the right. It's the tabletop. Another tabletop. Tail whip. I'm trying to figure out these tricks. What's the other bar spin that I just did? Keep doing tables. Here's the bar spin where he uses his right hand. I think this other one is a bar spin with the left hand. There's the tabletop again. Come on. Keep doing tables. Okay. So there are opposite bar spins. Same thing with tabletops, it looks like. Tabletop is the right. Tabletop to the left. Okay. So I did not know that. Are there different tail whips? Okay, there's a table tail whip to the left. And then tail whip to the right. Okay. Makes sense. And then Superman C grab is down. Tuck no hinder is up. Got it. Huge Superman C grab right out of the gate there. I love doing the 360 backflip with a tail whip thrown in. I was trying to combo it up and it didn't work. Oh, I'm gonna land right on top. Oh, yeah! Making it happen. Double flip. Perfect ending. That was a super clean run. So satisfying. I'm gonna do one more, and then I'm gonna head over to Joyride. <laughs> Unrealistic backflip right on the roll-in. Oh, my dead. That was huge right off the start. Man, I'm going for it this time. I'm really going to try and get some big tricks on every jump. It might be ridiculous, but I think it's going to be really fun just to try and go as big as possible. Oh, 
Oh man, I'm done. <laughs> oh no! I'm not gonna have the speed for this one. I'm for sure coming up short. Yeah. I love the double backflip right off the gate, though. Right off the start. Can I get a 720 double backflip? I don't know if that's gonna be doable. Yeah. It'd be really cool if they had the downhill course on here too. Besides just the slope style course. Then I could test the downhill bike and the the dirt jumper. Yeah. Dude, that jump actually might be it. I might be able to get that 720 double backflip. Yeah. Tuck my hand to 360 off the start. Front flip over the hip. <laughs> I don't know, man. Yeah. Throwing in that extra spin and flip yeah. is like a completely different, completely different animal. I think the height's there. It's just getting the perfect pop off of it. Because I have the backflip threes all day. <laughs> Straight to flat. I went for it. I'm gonna try it one more time. If I can't get it here, I'm just gonna take it over to Joyride and see if I can get it there. I'm gonna see if I can get a 720 first, and then if I can get this, then throw a double backflip in, and I think it's doable. I know a double backflip is possible off of that jump. Yeah. There's a 360 double backflip. That might be as close as I can get. Trying to throw that extra, that extra 360 in, really makes it difficult. Oh man, this run's going nowhere fast. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna go over to Joyride now. Now I'll get to try this bike here at the 2017 Red Bull Joyride course, and I think this one it might be a little bit easier to get the. Um, Double backflip 720. I think this course might have a few, a few more jumps that are bigger. But again, this is gonna be really fun to kind of see if I can make it to the bottom here on this first go, because it seemed to work. Oh, I'm screwed. Oh no, I made it. <laughs> it seemed to work really good on the last course, but this part right here, I remember being really, really difficult on the regular enduro bike. So I did not get it on the first try. Maybe second. Try this drop right over here. Man, yep, that's the jump right there. If I'm gonna get the double backflip 720, that's the jump. Double backflip 360. Again, that 720 is so tough to get. Dude, huge! That jump might be too big for this bike. I just coast right off the drop there, off the start. Man, it lands so hard. You can tell that this bike does not have any rear suspension. Because it does not give at all when you land. It's super rigid. Which is cool. I really like that the different bikes have different physics. That really adds to this game. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what I just did right there when I got up on top. Man, this jump, casing it again. If I go a little bit higher here, I might be able to make that without hopping. Yeah, this one's a little bit more difficult than uh, than Rotorua was. No hop three. Yeah! Oh, I missed the jump. Dude, that Mohawk 360 is so cool. I love that. The whip. Paste it. I want to get a clean run through here. I know it's possible, but this is just a little bit, a little bit more difficult compared to the previous level that I was just riding. <laughs> Oh, 
I'll flip off the drop. Yeah. Dude, I might be able to triple backflip that jump. Here we go. Got that first line clean. That first section. Let's see if I can continue it right here. Yeah, okay, I pretty much can go stop right there. Dude, jumping up on top of that thing is actually really tough. Yeah. There it is. Oh, <laughs> oh no, I did not ride away from it. Oh, come on right here. I don't know, dude. I don't know. I don't think it's going to happen on this jump. I think my problem is I don't have enough height for it. And if I do manage to get enough height for it, I'm going too long and I land a flat. And the bike just cannot take that type of impact to flat. Maybe on the downhill bike, it might work, but not on this hardtail. So instead of trying to go for the crazy triple backflip, I'm just going to try and get a clean run here. But starting off with a double backflip is not too bad. This course is also a little bit more narrow, I think, compared to uh, to the last one. So that also makes it a little bit more difficult because you just have to make sure that you're staying on the trail because it's really easy to get off the edge of it. <laughs> Might have cased it just a little bit. Dude, that jump is not easy. Probably should not hop there. There you go, getting on top. And then popping off the other side. Here we go. I still got a little bit of bounce on that one. It wasn't perfect. But I'm gonna keep it going anyway. Let's see if I can actually manage to get all the way to the bottom without screwing up. Oh my god. Come on, dude. That jump every single time is killing me. This one's not much better. This is a pretty frustrating course. This thing's not easy. I will say that it's more difficult to link up all of your tricks on this one. This course is tough, dude. I just feel like the sweet spots to land are a lot smaller on this slope style course compared to the Rotorua one. It's just trying to land perfectly on every jump. You've got to really be spot on with it. That was a good first half, though. This part right here is where it really gets me. Because it's so tight when you jump up on there. I cannot get that jump. I don't know if it's possible on this bike. Because if, remember, this course when it was made, this uh, this bike wasn't out yet, so it just could be that that jump right up there is just not made for this bike at all. I'm gonna try and hit this jump and see if I can get it. Try and figure this thing out. <laughs> oh, there it is. <laughs> of course. Yeah. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. I get it. As soon as uh, as soon as I stop doing the full run oh well thank you guys so much for checking out this video if you enjoyed it hit the like button subscribe for more content if you're new around here and i will catch all of you guys coming up in the next video have a good one